Hello everybody. It is April 10th, 2020. We are in the middle, or whatever you want to call it, of the coronavirus that has hit worldwide in some form or the other. I'm not going to take a lot of time to go through theories and what I believe that's really going on. But I'm coming on here for what it's worth. I don't even know in a few days if YouTube will still be around. But in the event it is, you'll be watching this video later. Lots of changes are coming to our Earth. Lots of things are happening. And I don't know about you, but I am excited. <laughs> How can you be excited amidst what some people are terming a crisis? How can you be excited amidst change? Maybe some of us have been living throughout this life just feeling as if we don't belong here. Feeling as if the ideologies and the consciousness and the way things have been done for even thousands of years has not resulted in the world being a place that is full of love, full of compassion, a place where, I don't know, just a place to where, how it's supposed to be. Could it be that a lot of our limiting beliefs have actually caused this world to get worse instead of better? Time will tell. But I can tell you one thing, and that is, I have learned, especially recently, having found out that I'm an empath, light worker, star C, whatever you want to fully call it, that my intuition has been correct more times than not. And my intuition is telling me that I am, that something is about to happen. It's going to be big. It's going to be epic, and for the most part, I'm excited about it. For one of the first part or times in my life, I'm actually not sitting here, oh, it's going to happen, oh. And there's a lot of different reasons for that. One of them, I realized now as an empath, I was picking up the global energies of everybody else going, oh, it's going to happen. I no longer do that, but I do pick up gut feelings. And my gut feeling is something exciting is about to happen. And I'm ready. I'm like, let's go. You know, if it can be a beautiful world where people are full of love, loving one another, uniting for the common good of one another, being a voice to those that have not been able to speak, that's been important. I know even in my own life, I've been shut down so many times. I finally stopped listening to those that tell me, don't say that. Don't post that on social media. Don't do it. Keep your mouth shut. Don't tell anybody. Don't live for you. Don't do your thing. Don't love yourself. You know, follow the sheep. Just shut up and be quiet and follow everybody else. And I've done that for 38 years in my life. Tomorrow is my birthday. I will be turning 39 tomorrow. It's probably the last video I'm going to do at a 38 years old of age. And you know, it really doesn't matter. But what I can tell you is, is that the world's about to get better. Things are going to change. You know, sometimes it's gotta get a little worse than it's gotta get better. But with that, I am at a point where, oh my God, it is just like the plane has landed. It's like the ship has come in. And you know, you taxi to the gate and there's that moment when the pilot will not turn off the seatbelt sign and you're sitting there and you're like, I want to freaking stand up for crying out loud This it's been a four plus hour flight and I haven't moved and I need a pee really bad. And you're waiting and you're waiting and you're waiting and you're in the back of the plane and finally the lights go off and finally the first guy stands up and suddenly it's a domino effect but you still can't get out. 
you're feeling this way, feel free to leave a comment. Um, there are others that have reached out to me, particularly through Facebook, that have said they're feeling the exact same thing. Hey, it's something is about to happen. Uh, we have had moon patterns, the pink super moon. We had a massive meditation on April the 4th and 5th. That was one of my first mass meditations I've ever been a part of. We're able to change the frequencies uh, of the earth. Uh, that is absolutely amazing. I'm learning more about that. Um, so it's, it's exciting times we live in. And uh, I'm just getting started. I'm just uh, really excited. But uh, maybe, maybe you're like me and you just can't wait to anticipate what is about to happen. Uh, it's about to be epic and it's gonna be good. And so I encourage all my light workers, um, star seeds, empaths, whatever you call yourself, get ready. You got your lightsabers. It's about time to start increasing our love and the frequencies to at least 528 megahertz and let's burn out all the hate and the disregard for mankind. And uh, let's do this thing. I'm ready to rock and roll. How about you?